Welcome to VSR Academy. Today we will discuss some numerical problem based on matrices. For example, we have a manufacturer produces three products X, Y, Z, which he sells in two markets. So we have the data that is the annual data. So we have market one and two. The salesman sells three products in the market. For example, he sells X at ten thousand rupees, Y at two thousand rupees, Z at eighteen thousand rupees in market one. Similarly, in market two, X sales with six thousand, Y twenty thousand, and Z eight thousand. We have given also that the cost of X is two point five rupees, Y is one point five rupees, and Z is one point zero rupees. So, according to this data, we will form a matrix, and using the matrix multiplication, we will solve the numerical problem. So, our question states that find the total revenue in each market. Suppose suppose we have some numerical question in algebra. Then what we do? We just multiply x with this amount, y with this amount, and z with this amount, so that we can have the total revenue. Similarly, we will form the matrix in the same way. We can have the each multiplication. So I can form this matrix as since this matrix is of two cross three, and I want to calculate with this data. The revenue of these products. So, this ten thousand should be multiplied with x, and we know the multiplication in the matrix is formed like row into column. So we have x. For this, we should have y, and for this, z. So we have a column matrix of three cross one. Now, the resultant will be the total revenue of each market. On multiplication, we will have the two elements. That is, this multiplied by this will produce the revenue of market one, and this multiplied with this will produce the revenue at two. We know that since x is equals to 2.5, y is equals to 1.5, and z is equals to 1.0. So I will put these data at there, and I will produce. The multiplication. So we have this matrix is of two cross three, and this matrix is three cross one. So the resulting matrix will be order of two cross one. So this means we will have two rows and one column. So if I multiply with this row and this column, we'll have ten thousand into two point five. Plus two thousand into one point five plus eighteen thousand into one that is eighteen thousand. Similarly, with this row and this column, six thousand into two point five twenty thousand into one point five. Plus eight thousand into one, that is eight thousand. Now I will simply add these and these. So I will have two point five into ten thousand, which is two five triple zero. One point five into two, that is three triple zero. Plus eighteen thousand, and here. 2.5 into 6 that is so on adding this row we'll have 25000 plus 3000 that is 28000 plus 18000 which is 46000 so the first element will be 46000 and the second 15000 plus 30000 that is 45000 plus 8000 which is 53000 So this was the required matrix, and this was the revenue of the first company, that is first market, and this is for the second market. So in this way, we can calculate the revenue or the total cost or the selling price of any product. Suppose if we have question that find the total profit if the cost of the X is two rupees, the cost of Y is one rupee, and the cost of Z is 0.5, and we have this selling price. So, 
if I want to calculate how much profit I gain, I can form another matrix as. So I can write as profit on X is equals to 2.5 minus 2, which is 0.5. Similarly, profit on Y is equals to 1.5. Minus one that is 0 0.5 and profit on Z is equal to 1 minus 0 0.5 which is 0 0.5. So we have a profit of 0 0.5, 0 0.5 and 0 0.5 in each product. So I can form form the matrix in the same way as in the previous question just by replacing these values with these new values. So we have the profit on each market is so we have this for x this for y and this for z on simple multiplication we have 10,000 into 0.5 that is 5,000 2000 into 0.5 that is 1000 plus 18000 into 0.5 that is 9000 similarly 6000 into 0.5 that is half of 6000 that is 3000 similarly the half of 20000 is 10000 and 4000 for the 8000 on adding this we have 9 plus 1 10 and we have 15000 3 plus 10 13, 13 plus 4 is 17. So this is profit on market 1 and this is the profit on market 2. So in this way we can solve any numerical problem that is given on the matrices. So everything that we have studied in this video you can download the PDF link provided in the description. So go and check the description and download the PDF. If you like this video, share with your friends and subscribe the channel so that you can watch the upcoming videos. Thank you.